Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to today's video. I am so happy today because it's so warm outside. It's the first day of the semester that it's 70 degrees out. Everyone's just outside soaking up the sun. I'm about to go outside and tan with Maya, but I'm vlogging all weekend because there's so much fun stuff going on. The next few days we have the lead up to Songfest, which is our big sorority frat dance competition. We have practice tonight for six hours. And tomorrow it goes for five hours and then it's basically the whole day we're gonna be there on Saturday and then Sunday is DG's philanthropy which is like a charity event for the year I'll show you the shirt sorry some of this stuff is probably repetitive if you saw my last video but if you didn't see it this is the shirt for the event we have pizza and puppies come because our charity philanthropy that we support is service for sight so we work with guide dogs and that's the event for Sunday it's almost one I went to class this morning and then came back here just got a little work done did my hair and I still have yet to unpack. I'm gonna put this Paxson suit on. If you're looking for a cute suit for a summer trip, you should look on Paxson because they have a lot of cute ones for less. And this pattern's super cute. Today is such a tease for summer because it's gonna go back to being cold in the next few days. There's still snow on the mountain, so. Anyway, I'm finally putting this thing to use. It was cheap on Amazon and I brought it with me in case I ever wanted to, like, go to the pool and not use my bath towels. Since we start dance at five tonight, I got a sandwich from the grab and go to eat for dinner. And I also got some veggie sushi to eat outside and strawberries. Oh crap, I left them in my bag, hold on. Edamame, here they are, and this for tomorrow. I'm doing all this stuff where I just think to myself, I know I'm tired. I tried to turn on my curling iron while I was holding the plug in one hand and the curling iron in the other hand, not even thinking straight. Also, someone asked to see a layout of our room, which I I totally will show because I realize that I don't really ever show much in the room besides my corner. So in case you're new, I'll just briefly show you the layout. So these are Emily and Kira's closets when you walk in. We have all our snacks and coffee maker, fridge, just everything in this little tower. And this is Kira's nook and she made this back in the fall during football season. And then my mess is over here. And obviously the closet's back here too. And I have this Stormify mirror. I'm gonna change and then go tan. It's way later. This is the worst, most yellow lighting, but we made it to Songfest practice. I'm eating my sandwich for dinner right now, and we're. It's so hot. Dying. It is so hot. Look at my jeans. Look at Ryan's jeans. We're in the basement of the old gym, so it's just kind of weird down here, but I finally unpacked, got a little bit of work done, and then I was tanning. So I'll keep you guys updated. This is hour one, it's five o'clock. And we'll be here till 11. Hey guys! Chloe Michelle is in the house. Hey, hey, Thank you. So Thank yeah, it you. So Update hour two. It's like 6.30 almost. And we are just cleaning all the dances. I cannot get over how weird the lighting in here is. It just makes everything look... I thought my turkey and my sandwich looked gray, but it was just the light in here. So it's weird. This is our current activity. Oh! oh. I'm working on this right now and then I'm gonna edit if I have enough time. Okay, update, it's hour three, it's 8.32. And all the seniors are here, we're gonna perform for them. And I think that's all I have. I actually can't believe how disgusting this lighting is, but. We got our shirts, they say 24 on the front. And then Rihanna is on the back, it says Songfest 2024. Great news, we got let out early from practice. We got let out at like 9.30 and then me and my friend Stella were there cleaning up stuff and we didn't get back to like 10 something. I just made some tea. This tea and the Trader Joe's well-rested tea are my all-time favorites. Also, new angle unlocked. This is sitting in my suitcase right now. I am literally zoning out. I had so much to talk about but I can't remember what was on my mind. One thing I wanted to talk about was my living situation for next year. And I think the other thing was just all the stuff I have to do still. Some of it I can push till tomorrow or push to tomorrow because I have a lot of afternoon free, which will be nice. I could just go somewhere, maybe a coffee shop and just lock in. This was exactly what I needed. I've also eaten just like if anyone else feels bad about all I've eaten today. I'm about to get my period and I literally have eaten every single thing in my line of view. 
actually everything that's probably why i'm also feeling tired we were sweating in that room it was super hot down there like i was saying so i'm gonna go shower really quick and then i will report back i need to talk about this living situation the whole rooming thing because i feel like it'll be good to keep you guys in the loop and just document the whole process because i would have never thought of this stuff or had any idea what it was like to prepare to move into a sorority house without actually preparing to move into a sorority house so i think it's interesting I'm all clean and ready for bed and I changed my sheets today and there's nothing better than being showered and in clean sheets. Anyway, I promised I would talk about the living situation. Basically, as you guys know, I'm living in the Delta Gamma house and there's... I don't really know how to fully explain this. So there's four singles total. The nicest one is given to the girl who gets the position for house manager. I applied for that position but didn't get it. So now if I want a single, I'll have to choose between the three other ones, which is totally fine because they're all really good options. I was freaking out for a little bit because I didn't know whether or not I was actually going to be able to get a single because everything is based on points. Like you get first room pick if you have the most points that kind of thing and I didn't know how high up on the list I was and I didn't know if anyone above me points wise was also wanting a single so I'm like in 10th or 11th place and there's only one girl above me that also wants a single and I probably won't catch her in points so hopefully I'll get to pick between two different singles we'll see I don't know I just am glad to have some peace of mind that I'll have a single next year and be able to have my own space and kind of film whenever that was out of focus um i was gonna say i was considering another triple because there's one triple in the house that is i think probably smaller than the room we have now but it has its own bathroom anyway i'm glad that i never fully committed to rooming with someone else there are girls i would love to room with in dg and i just think it would be so fun to have a roommate because now if i am guaranteed a single for next year this dorm is probably the last time i'll ever have a roommate as in sharing a room with someone. I'm sure I'll have roommates for the rest of college as in living in the same house or apartment, but I am crossing my fingers that I will have a single room in the house next year. And I was, I went back and forth with a lot of things because I was also worried about whether or not, and I still kind of am worried about all these things like being lonely, being not isolated, I guess. I don't know what the right word is, you know, having a single, but I love being around people and I'm sure that I will not be spending a lot of time in my room besides getting ready, filming, things like like that because I rarely spend that much time in here besides filming and I feel like you get what I'm saying but I was worried about that and I've been reassured by all the girls who live in the singles like I've really tried to reach out and talk to everyone I can and all those girls have said there's always people out and about around the house and realistically I will not be in my room very often because I'm not in this room even very often I'm always on the go doing things kind of going from here to the next thing so i'll try to keep you guys updated but i'm going to be busting my butt for points because i really want to make sure that i can get a single because i would just hate to i know all the girls are so nice that are living in and i'm sure that everyone would be wonderful to live with but it would be really hard if i kind of ended up with someone i didn't really know that's the sitch i hope that made sense i'll keep you guys updated with everything but for now i'm gonna read my bible and go to bed and i will see you in the morning i only have one class and then it's gonna be a busy but fun friday i'm just gonna like go willy-nilly and open this to something random so i'm 18 i'm gonna get through as much as i can until I feel like I'm gonna fall asleep. I will link my Bible because I just love it so much. It's so beautiful and it has so much pretty art and it was a gift I got for Christmas a couple years ago. Okay, I will see you guys tomorrow. Happy Friday guys, I'm working on this TikTok that I have to finish because I was supposed to submit it yesterday, but I did not. It's for a brand deal. Hold on. My manager's about to call me. I'm like, <sighs> I went to class this morning though, and then I went to Target with some of my friends to get those baskets I was talking about yesterday. I think I talked about them. I'm going a little bit crazy. Anyway, before I jump on this call, it makes me sound so corporate. I want to show you guys what I got from Target. I only have one class on Friday, so it makes them great, and it's really nice if I'm traveling on the weekends. I can just leave after that class. It's only 50 minutes, so it's a super quick class, and usually it ends early. And today I'm trying to use all my extra time to get work done because tomorrow I'm probably not going to have a lot of time to do that. Anyway, I'm going to cut this out if I already talked about it yesterday, but we're getting baskets for all the upperclassmen who run Songfest. There was five of us that went to Target to get the supplies, so 
we all got kind of one of each thing. We got little baskets, face masks, these chocolates to put in each of the baskets. I got vitamin water for my girl because I know she likes these, but we also got like poppies and other drinks. Starbucks gift card, some more snacks. We got Skinny Pop, Pirate Foodie, tissue paper as filler. We got a bunch of cough drops too because they've been yelling over all our talking, so we thought it was funny. And then we all got funny cards. So this one says to a cute girl who's won. And they're all first birthday cards because we want to win first place. Guess who's back? I finally got my second wind of energy. <laughs> we are all just dying. Look who's on the phone. Hey, are you busy or no? I'm at Songfest practice. I just realized I have a 2,000 work day for you on Sunday that I have Are you serious? <laughs> it's just a buffer. Sorry I didn't vlog earlier. I was just running around a little bit crazy and then um, I yeah. have a call. I'm actually going insane. I just was on my computer basically the rest of the afternoon after I had that call for like an hour and then we came here at 5 and it's now 6.24. And allegedly, they're bringing us pizza. You know what? It's only been an hour, and Joe Dance Boys is my state. Oh, but we're ready. Oh, it's Allie's birthday! <laughs> all right, time check. It is 12 24 a.m. I have the room all to myself because Kira and Emily went to a concert tonight. They're at Dom Dalla at Red Rocks, and I think they're probably on their way back by now, but. I'm gonna shower and get ready for bed. We'd finished practice at like nine something and we all had pizza for dinner. I've just been hanging out with all my friends downstairs, but I'm gonna get in the shower. I actually feel like so crusty and sticky and I'm trying to get this off because I really need to shower. Also, oh my gosh, that room is so, like I'm breaking out on my back from sweating, but we're all so excited for tomorrow morning and we have to meet for the dress rehearsal at like 10, 15. I'm gonna get everything set out before I go to bed so I don't forget anything. I feel like I'm back in, cheer in high school literally but we're meeting in the morning and then we have a little break midday and then we go back to dg and we walk together to the basketball arena aka event center aka where the whole competition is happening so we're all really excited and pumped today was a good day it was kind of weird earlier i just like didn't do much besides be on my computer and get work done which i needed to do but tomorrow's gonna be super fun and i'm vlogging everything we're all doing slick backs tomorrow so i'm not gonna wash my hair but i Definitely need to shave and wash my body. Time to shower. I'm making more tea. Happy Saturday, happy song fest day. I'm in Ryan and Maya's room. I've taken over Maya's desk completely. We have our energy drinks and we're getting ready. We had a rehearsal this morning and then our little break like I was talking about yesterday and me and Ryan went to the gym and did Pilates and we took a really funny time lapse. So I will insert that here. But it's been a fun day so far and I'm so excited for tonight. We have song fest and then after, basically the frat that we're paired with is hosting us for a party after and Ryan's boyfriend Jackson is in that frat. So it's gonna be just a bunch of our friends and we're gonna have a super fun night. I have a mystery stain on my sleeve. I don't know where this came from, but I'm wearing my DG merch. Here's the star of the show. Woo! I guys, I'm has so the main nervous. character role. I'm more nervous to perform in front of our sorority than like the five other thousand the, other the judges. People. Yeah, I'm way more nervous to perform in front of like the seniors and them. It's just because it's a big tradition for DG yeah. and everyone's super excited to come watch. And like they are like hard on us, but in a good way. They're yes. like really want us to win and they want us to like have fun. Mm -hmm. And so More they're excited. like, they're like, be dedicated to this because you'll build relationships. But I'm like. <laughs> We have to be at the house at 4.45 and it's 4.13 right now and we're gonna Uber because it is so ridiculously windy outside. They cut the power in the rest of Boulder. I think campus has generators or backups or something so we don't have power lost, but and the like rest the of the have. county, the hill doesn't have power? Can you explain so like, if you don't The mind? neighborhood, that's like, so basically we're on campus and right across the street from campus is like all of the like um, housing for yeah. the next years of mm -hmm. students. From like the campus here, like say the campus is like this big, the hill goes like around it and this side of the hill their power is off, the other but the side, other side is on. has power? Yeah, and that's the side we're gonna be on. 
The one that has power? Yeah, for dogs. Oh my god. So we're gonna be on the side that has power. We're so lucky. We're gonna get ready and I will update you guys when we get to the house. <laughs> what? Oh, oh my god! You look like an alien. <laughs> oh my guys, god. This slick bag is a very delicate so piece pretty. of work. <laughs> this I don't want her as fashion like <laughs> In what world? <laughs> they wouldn't even let you in. Gigi Hadid would pull out something like this and everyone would be like, oh, how to do the Gigi Hadid hairstyle. <laughs> and it would be like, it's really bad. I'm turning into you. Oh, that's a compliment. <laughs> Anyways, here's Moi. Um, should I do it a little fit Show check? us your outfit. So we got the Backstreet, you gotta play Backstreet Boys. Maya's team is Backstreet copyright? Boys. No, it's Wait. okay, we should be talking over the copyright. Hat is from Kappa, shirt's from Boulder, jeans are Levi, shoes are Adidas, Oh my god! Oh. Are you no! Okay? <laughs> my bras are everywhere. This are is you awful. Okay? Ow, my foot. Oopsies. Um, yeah, we're getting ready for song fest. Kappa's got Backstreet You're Boys. You really can't leave the Backstreet Boys. Do you think that Kappa will beat DG? It's gonna be... I'm just... I'm not gonna say anything. Can I say hi to someone? Yeah. That I know will watch this. Hi, Sally! <laughs> hi, Zoe! Hi, Mom and Dad. Hi, Millie. Hi, Millie. Hi, Audrey. Hi, Brad. They're gonna You're think like, that you have a boyfriend. I don't have a boyfriend, so any cuties can <laughs> hit me up anytime. Oh, okay. Okay. We need to cut her off. Oh, We're okay. really early. I'm DJ so is are all rock stars and the funniest people I know, and this has been the best experience. And seriously, we're gonna kill it, and we're gonna. Okay, I haven't vlogged anything, but we went on and we had so much fun and we're about to find out who won. I will insert videos of our performance so you can see. I'm cutting all of this footage if we don't win. <laughs> this was the most fun thing ever. We all had such a great weekend and such a great night this night. And this is like one of the things I feel like I'll be telling my kids about from college and just talking about with my sorority sisters for years because it was so much fun. We had our event the next day and there were a bunch of puppies at the house and it was just adorable. Katie's been hogging the dog for about like five minutes I know. now. She won't give it to anyone else. She won't let anyone hold the dog. Touch There's it, like one dog to go around. Oh, she just gave it away. All right. What? That was the sweetest thing ever. I wish we could have known how sweet it was. Yeah, I wish we could Oh my god. It. Flip it up so you can see yourself. Oh, no, now we can see ourselves. Us. So cute. Mm. Oh, <laughs> <it's> so cute. <laughs> it was such a fun weekend. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog, and I will see you soon in the next one. This was my favorite puppy, the little golden retriever. He was so cute.